Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvania toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we will be reviewing something from Transformers, Universe Classics, Legends, Optimus Prime. And this is the second release of the Legends Optimus Prime. I don't have the first one with the sword. But I got the uh, second release of this figure. Sorry, I had to correct myself there. But it's not a bad looking truck mode for a little Legends figure. And he rolls very well for a little Transformer. He's got visible seats. Feet Syndrome. So he's got Visible Feet Syndrome. <laughs> Otherwise, a good-looking figure. Really well-sculpted. Really well-painted. Not a bad-looking Legends figure. But that's all there is to say for vehicle mode. And he rolls very well. Let's get down to transformation. We're going to disconnect the wheels from the body. Fold the arms around, turn around the chest, lower the arms, and flip up the head. And there you got Legends Optimus Prime in his robot mode. And this is a cute looking little Optimus Prime I own, huh? But now we're going to compare it with some other evolutions of Optimus Prime. But this is a cute little Optimus Prime to add to your collection if you can find it for a good price. Here he is next to Kingdom's Core Class Optimus Prime. This one's probably the better Prime in that wave. And of course, here he is next to my original Machine Wars, Optimus Prime. This is the third best looking Optimus Prime in the toy line. That's all there is to say for this comparison. You're probably wondering, where did I get this little Optimus Prime from? Well, I originally got this guy from Dollar General when I started collecting Transformers. I got this guy for five bucks. Is he worth adding to your collection if you're a Transformers fan and you just love Optimus Prime, the leader of the Autobots? Yes, he is worth the money to add to your Optimus Prime collection. Because he's a cute looking little Optimus Prime. He Got an Autobot insignia on his arm. I wish they would have put him on his shoulders. That's the only nitpick I have about this old school figure. They could have put the Autobot insignia on the arm rather than the car parts. But that's the good thing about it. And yes, he is worth adding to your collection. If you love Optimus Prime and you're a huge collector of Optimus Primes. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.